haven't spoken to you in a while, so let's uh, talk about that great Supercross season. Yeah, that was quite a uh, comeback from the uh, depths of privateer, <laughs> no ride hell, huh? Yeah, almost. I was almost uh, down and out, but uh, luckily I got the opportunity from Mitch, and uh, I mean, I'm real thankful for, for, for that opportunity, and, and uh, everything worked out. I was real happy with my bike, and my setup and everything over there, everything just, I couldn't be happier, so it all worked out for the best. series, you know, they said, got to be on the podium, got to be on the podium. I mean, heck, you pulled through and, and really uh, fulfilled your commitments, didn't you? Yeah, I mean, uh, it, before the season started, I was, I felt really good on the bike and everything. I rode, I was riding all day, every day, and I felt felt really good. And I mean, in the past, I haven't been really consistent, so, I mean, that was my main focus. I wanted to be really consistent. And after the first round, getting second, um, I knew that 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 goal was uh, was was realistic. I knew I, I could be there every single weekend. So I had that one one bad bad week in the next weekend, but after that, I, I was on the podium every week. So it worked out. <laughs> So you've had, man, you've had quite a few different rides and ridden quite a few different bikes. Uh, how do your bikes this year compare to uh, previous machines? Uh, it really is. My bike this year is unbelievable. It's, it's really, really good. I mean, when I rode for Factory Connection, I always, I always had really good bikes there, too. I mean, I think Mitch's bikes are just a step ahead of, of everybody else's. So I'm, I'm really happy with my bike. I couldn't be happier. I mean, I've... Honestly, it would suck to, to honestly lose this ride because I know I know how fast these bikes are now. So my goal, I want to just just uh, try to keep what I have. So that's that's my goal. So when we kept asking you if you're uh, going to be on the team for the nationals, you, you kept saying, "I don't know. I'm scared to ask." Yeah, <laughs> I, I asked Mitch a couple times. He said, "Oh no, we'll see, we'll see," and he didn't let me know until after the last race that I did have a ride for outdoors. So it was pretty cool. <laughs> So at Vegas, you tweaked your ankle on that uh, dry section of the track, right? Yeah, I stuck. I don't know what happened. I was in second. I came into that corner a little hot. I was, I mean, I was too anxious to get in the lead, I guess. But I came in that corner, lost the front end. I, I guess I put my leg out in a hole or something. And I actually fractured my, my tibia. So yeah, I was really bummed because nationals, I was, I was feeling good for nationals. And that just totally screwed me. I mean... I raced Hangtown, but I can't. I couldn't even put my leg out or anything. And then I tried to race Mount Morris, and I was actually in second there and got it caught in a hole there. And just, I mean, I, I pulled off the track and took my boot off, and I seen a lump. I thought the bone was gonna come out, but I guess it was just uh, swollen really bad in one spot or something. So it's still, still not not 100%, but it's getting better, and uh, hopefully come back. I'm thinking about this weekend, but if not, then I'll be back at Redbud for sure. So over the years, we've seen you uh, tweak your ankles, your feet, your lower leg, how many times? And uh, Give us a rundown. How many times has stuff been broken down there? I don't know. My, it's, it seems like it's always my left leg. My left leg's pretty, pretty screwed up, but... It's been a lot, but I try to <laughs> try to not do it. But it seems to always happen to catch a hole or something somehow. So 
We gotta stay away from uh, the ruddy tracks, I guess. You ever think about applying for a uh, handicap placard so you don't have to walk that far when you park? Oh, I think about that every time. I know I can get one. I just gotta show them a picture of my foot and they'll give me one. <laughs> Maybe I should just hang a picture of my foot from my window and they'll just accept that.